back. Welcome back on this Thursday morning. Let's quickly go over that forecast. No rain to even worry about or really talk about. And that's a good thing. We've got a race to talk about in just a moment. 45 degrees out there. Grab a light jacket. It's a little cool out there. A lot of you are going to think it feels mighty good, though. High temperatures today around 68. Tomorrow, your high of 76. Partly cloudy skies. The weekend, absolutely gorgeous. Talk about a wonderful, wonderful another year for a great Great, we well, wonderful weather for a race. Saturday, look at there. You know that Saturday morning should be about 55 degrees, hopefully. Yeah, we hope so. <laughs> Looks like it's going to be a nice day. Drop that out a little bit, but do runners really, I mean, does that really affect them? Uh, it's like 75, 80 degrees already at 8 o'clock in the morning. That would be miserable. There, I mean, if you're, you're a runner, you're hoping for that 50 to 60 degrees. Yeah. It's going to be what, it, that'll be nice. So it'll be good weather. So it'll be cool because once you get started running, it's going to be a, you're going to warm up. So We're talking about the annual Chick-fil-A race, which happens, of course. This is probably the sixth or seventh year that Matthew's been doing that. And always find something wonderful to do the charity for. This time it is Loads of Love. So you can check them out on Facebook. Find out more about them. Loads of Love right there. There's their website. All right. Last year you were able to raise how much? Uh, I think last year we were around uh, around fifteen thousand dollars. So, yeah, that's awesome. yeah. so it's it's always been a good uh, a good yeah. good event, a good way to, to give back to the community. So between sponsors and uh, runners and things like that. So. Are you shocked at how many runners there are in this area? We seem to have a lot. Yeah, there's a lot. I mean, right now we're around uh, we're around uh, four hundred that are signed up. So I, I guess we'll have a little bit over five hundred come Saturday morning. So, but uh, you know I. I I, I don't think so. I mean, I, I go to some other races around here, and I, yeah. I see the people out there, and um, you know, there's a lot of people just. And uh, it's fun and to find a race, you right? Don't have to run it, right? It's it's fun to find something yeah. like this to do where you go out there in the excitement of all the other people, and you got people on the sidelines cheering you on, and then afterwards, there's such a big event there at your location. This is going to be on the square, though, right? Where you have everything set up. You've got the cow. You've got some vendors. You've got you feed them sandwiches. There's always usually some ice cream, something good, cool. Drink. Yeah, we'll have, we'll have lots of stuff out there. So, I mean, yeah, and there will be, like you said, there will be hundreds of people yeah. on the square between runners and volunteers right. and, <laughs> um, yeah, and just, just people to come in to support their, their family and friends. So it will be a, a big day. So and we're, the cow will be out there, too. You can race the cow. That's right. We'll, we'll, we'll have a, a small herd of cows <laughs> out there. So it will be, it'll be a lot of fun. So right. it should be a really we'll – Are have, you going to be running this year? I'm I'm not. I'll I'll be there. Yeah, I'll be, be working but yeah. So uh, registration down the store. You better. Register. You can register online today. Mm -hmm. So go to cfaraceseries.com. Um, you can find it on our Facebook page if you're looking for it. But uh, and then register at the store tomorrow, uh, four to seven. Um, you can also pick up your packets if you've pre-registered. And then uh, Saturday, you can register at the race, what 7 to 7.30. Okay, 7 to 7.30. Very important. If you don't get a chance to register and you want to participate, 7 to 7.30 is the time frame for that. Okay. Yeah, race starts 8 o'clock, Saturday morning, on the square. So. Always a big event, always fun. Yeah. And luckily, again this year, wonderful weather. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be a great day for running, so oh, looking funny. forward to how it. How far, how long is it? Uh, the 5K, 3.1 miles, 10K, 6.2 miles. So, yeah. And you can walk it. You can walk. A lot walk. of times people come out there with their child and, you know, they'll walk together. And, you know, they, I just see on TV where May is the best month to start a diet or anything. So if you want to put walking in that diet, there you go. There you go. Good Sign reason up. to do it. So <laughs> sure come on out and join us. What does the winner win? Uh, well, the winner will they'll get a, a medal and they'll get a, they'll get some uh, Chick-fil-A meals as a prize. So hey, Jim we'll Heiser, who does our RPM class for us on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday mornings at Riviera, he says he's going to win, but he's like, okay. boy, I'm going to be able to eat Chick-fil-A for a year. There you go. There you go. We'll, we'll, <laughs> we'll have see. a, yeah, we'll have awards for him. He's there, in so. the older division, though. Uh, hey, will you? I have to get that out. <laughs> Hey, well, that's good he's still running then. <laughs> he so. is. He does great and wonderful teacher. If you want to join us for an RPM class, let us know and we'll tell you more details on that. All right. Well, thank you for being with us this morning. Yeah. Well, thanks for having me. All it's right. good to be here. You're welcome. We're going to take a quick break. Stay with us. We're going to talk to Jonathan in just a moment. And we're going to check out that prowler, prowler in a little bit, too. We'll be right back.